Hi, it's Pastor Doug with my weekly update. It was good to experience some additional normality during our in-person worship this past Sunday as we welcome three new members into our church family. We'll be adding more this coming Sunday. This week, I'm scheduled to conduct a baptism by immersion for one of our children who's come to faith through the fabulous BG Kids online ministry during the past few months. We're planning on two more baptisms for children this coming Sunday. That's some great news. In addition to that, this past Sunday after worship, I had a youth tell me she wanted to be baptized. She is scheduled to do so in a couple of weeks. God is working among our BG students. That's more great news. So in these uncertain times of quarantine and separation, it's a simple joy to catch a glimpse of a masked face we've not seen in weeks or months. It's also encouraging to see evidence of the Holy Spirit at work drawing people into the family of faith. How are you welcoming the work of the Holy Spirit in your life these days? Are there signs that your soul is becoming more tender and responsive, or is it becoming more cynical and hardened? Are you offering more grace and understanding to one another, or are you being more critical and rigid with each other? As a Christ follower, are you making your ambition to be known more by your love for Jesus rather than your love for a political party or any other cause as worthy as it might be? Psalm 97, 10 to 12 says, Let those who love the Lord hate evil, for he guards the lives of his faithful ones and delivers them from the hand of the wicked. Light shines on the righteous and joy on the upright in heart. Rejoice in the Lord, you who are righteous, and praise his holy name. I love you. I look forward to seeing you soon.